the fastest and easiest way to complete collections, get the best cards in the game. And they'll be the show 23 stubs U4GM. Link is in the description. Let's go. Today we're going to go over how to pitch elite every single time. Certain pitchers that you want to look for, certain pitch types. Okay, so the outlier fastball or a regular fastball that can get up to 100 miles per hour. The cutter and the sinker and then any type of off speed circle change change up and then you want to have between four and eight speed differential so we're going to look at my pitch types and we're going to go through pitch tendencies but before we go any further drop a like on the video right now okay so you're going to see right here i'm going to bring in gregory santos end of the game my opponent doesn't have any runs we are looking to shut him down so we put in santos now we're going to look at the pitch mix that he has fastball sinker both of them get up to 100 miles per hour circle change and slider they can both get up in the 90s but they can go as low as 80 miles per hour now you're going to look at the pitch and sequence that i do i'm going to always take the par and I'm going to put it as far away from the strike zone as possible. Okay, we're going to slow the video down. I'm going to throw this slider. And I want it to land close to the strike zone to look like a strike, but right outside of it. Okay, now, if you are throwing everything in the strike zone in the game, it's going to be a chance that you're going to give up a lot of home runs. So as you can see, we throw two pitches, one right outside the strike zone, one way outside the strike zone seeing if he's going to be a chaser okay since he's not a chaser now we're going to throw one right outside the strike zone it could have been a strike if he took it and we get a late blooper for an out okay so this is the sequence this is the mindset that i'm going to be using it don't matter the type of cards that your opponent has he can have every 99 in the game he can have all the cards over 200k it's all about Seeing the ball, it's all about mixing up your pitches. So right here, we're going to start with a sinker in the zone instead of outside the zone. I've been throwing a lot of pitches outside the zone. So he takes that pitch, thinking it's not going to land in. Now we come with a slower pitch. He waited on the ball, so that was a good at-bat right there. He waited on the ball, but he was just a little too late. So now I am outside the box because the ball can land in any area close to the park. OK, so it travels through the strike zone, but it lands outside. As you can see right there, it is right on the white. Now we're going to be right there at the white to start the pitch so it can land anywhere. It can land right outside if you are perfect or it can land inside the box. OK, I want to always be either right on the white or a couple away from the white for my pitches. Now, when you look at where this one landed at, you're going to see this one. I was right on the white. My target was not 100% so it landed about two or three inches outside okay so you want to give yourself a little bit of space like that if you don't get that perfect it won't land right in the box so right there that one was a little too much inside the box could have been a home run okay high in the zone so now we are about five six inches outside but the ball is going to land boom right there right on the weight about two or three inches inside so now we're going to come high and above two strikes he has to be aggressive boom it travels up he swings he misses 99 miles per hour if you have outliers going to be 102 103 miles per hour it's going to be even better make sure that you have them pitch speeds like i said the meta pitches fastball outlier is the best sinker and cutter the top players in the world are top players because those are the pitcher types and pitches that they're going to be using. Now, as far as hitting, that's going to come down to your eyesight and patience. The fastest and easiest way to complete collections, get the best cards in the game. And they'll be the show 23 stubs U4GM. Link is in the description. Let's go.